What's up, guys? MMA Game here, bringing you another video. This is the next episode of the Top 50 UFC 4 Knockouts. If you want to submit your own clips to be featured in this series, check the link in the description. Make sure to head kick that like button to support the series and subscribe with notifications on to be notified anytime I upload on the channel. And in this episode, we will feature a special guest commentator that I'm sure all you know very well. Give it up for joe rogan thank you so much joe for taking the time out of your busy schedule to commentate the next top 50 knockouts my pleasure mma game i'm a huge fan of this series and have been watching it for years wow thanks joe that sure does mean a lot coming from you. All right, I'll take it from here. Let's get this episode to 5,000 likes. Coming in at number 50, it's Empty Brewski. Here we go, Rodriguez with the 360 spinning tornado head kick. Ooh. <laughs> he, he slept him. Next up at number 49 is that kid all the way from Guam, the Guamton kid. He's got his back up against the fence taking some shots. And boom, huge overhand knockout as he got rocked to the body. Unbelievable. Moving on to number 48, it's Shaylee. Looks like he's got to create a fighter. He gives him the middle finger, goes for the head kick. Bing! Hits him with a jab knockout for the win. Coming in at number 47, it's Theril Thomas Jefferson. 18 straight left combo, bouncing him around like a pickleball. Gorgeous. And here we go. 46, Spurdy Jara B. <laughs> he gets back up and delivers a huge haymaker of a right hand to his opponent's chin. Look at that animation. Next up, 45, it's We Are Life in Z. Hits the side sway and counters with the right hand, folds him up like the laundry with that shot. Number 44, we got Knockout Legend X. Finish him, X, who delivers a picture-perfect UFC 2 sweet chin music that sends his opponent flying. Golly! Next, it's 43. Boji Style, who sends a straight left hand right down the pipe, causes Leon to do the limbo. For number 42, it looks like we are on the ice with Brian Scotland. They're grabbing each other's collar trading punches. Oh, he sleeps him with a right hand and he lands face first. Next up, it's Petches at number 41. In smaller regional venue. Boom, cartwheel kick into another dimension. Number 40, it's Baldaboo. Hits the side sway hook for the knockout and connects with the body kick midair. Breathtaking. And next up, 39, it's Ilake back in UFC 2. <laughs> Another cartwheel head kick. Th that face plants his opponent. And now it's at 38 by I don't care how. Heavyweights exchange. Right hook lead uppercut and he shuts the lights off. Wow! Coming in at 37, it's MK Big Ben. No Jaria. Rothwell, UFC 2. Oh, he snipes him with that right. Beautiful animation. Let's take another look. Next up, 36, Halalola. Yes, why? They're up against the cage. Goes for a flying knee. What? Double knockout. I don't even know who won. We now move to number 35, Muhammad. Looks like he's got his calf. Hits the punch, followed by a picture-perfect spin kick that sends his opponent to the Shadow Realm. Next up, it's Thyler H at number 34. Oh, my. Big body shots against the fence. Ooh, he drops him. Next, it's number 33, Javega, 345. What's this? Oh, my word. Number 32, it's Boji style. Waves him in with the spider, ducks the head kick, and kapoo. Molly whoops him with that counter. Next in line, it's 31, Marcus Phoenix. Oh, my. He went for the cartwheel, but he counters him with a head kick. Somebody stop the fight. Number 30, Crab X, but he tries to go for cheese knee, but misses by a mile. Wowzers. Next up, number 29, it's Bo G style. Back at it again. Conor McGregor ducks the head kick and... <laughs> rolling in at number 28, it's Combat Zone Games. Shooting in for the takedown comes way short, and they land a huge counter knee. That was a downed opponent. That was an illegal shot. We now move to number 27 by AKA Compilation. The Hobby Lawler leaps into the air like a lizard with that head kick, and ah, RDA's neck about goes through the canvas. Sheesh. Next up, 26, Sauce Sauce 30. Knocks him down, hits the taunt, hits the dance, and Boom Shakalaka hits the Karate Kid jump kick. Exquisite technique. Moving on to number 25-2, Dwight the fourth side sways the front kick and connects with a crispy Celtic cross that crumbles his opponent. Next, number 24, all the way from the Hawaiian Islands, it's Kill a Shot Ta, who lands a truning side kick to the gonads. Ouch! That does not look pleasant. Now we're at number 23, it's Xerox changing in close, and oh man, Xerox lifts that knee up and connects. Brutal! Next up, it's number 22, Joger Bjorn, throws the head kick and follows it up with a spinning back fist. Okay, Joger. Back at it again. It's Tyler H at number 21. O'Malley versus Cruz. Sean jumps for the flying knee. Cruz times the side sway perfectly and chin checks him with a ruthless right hook. It's okay, sugar. 
And here we go. Number 20, it's dumb. <laughs> He's got McGregor and he drops Max against the cage. <gasps> but wait, what? <laughs> he appears to still be conscious, it, but the fight is over. Jumping Jaguars was that crazy. Number 19, we got him game 4,567 Bruce Lee action. Goes for the 360 degree spinning tornado head kick and boy oh boy does he land it. Spin two win strikes again. Next up 18, it's Gorilla Grumbles. Waits for him to get up and boom. Now we move on to number 17 where A Kesare compilation is back. Gets the KO <laughs> and what's this? <sighs> She just sits there. What the? Uh, is that it? Oh no, what's this? She starts to spin randomly around like a psychedelic disco ball on steroids. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, up next we've got Bojay's style at number 16. His opponent's going for an overhand right. Boom! That's what I call precision striking. Next up, we are Liv NZ coming in at 15. He just got knocked down and flicked off like a bug on a windshield. He's back on his feet and landing a beautiful sidestep and countering with a crushing overhand right. Hayes Rockets is up next at number 14. Bruce Lee goes for the spin kick counter to intercept the cartwheel kick. Bonkers. Next up, it's 13. We are live NZ. Showing each other respect in the center of the octagon, but he moves in closer and sends a scintillating summer salt heel kick directly to his opponent's off switch. Good night. Here we go. Number 12, NZ Trooper 716, Aldo versus Garbrandt. And oh, what a move by Aldo. A spinning back elbow that caught Cody off guard and sent him soaring into the stratosphere, while Buddy really got sent into orbit. Next up at number 11, it's your boy, Dark Oni MC. He's got Masvidal going up against GSP. George goes for a head kick, and Dark ducks it and sleeps him with that hook. Oh my goodness, was that powerful. Starting off the top 10, it's Tall Feek alum, Aldo versus Magomed Sharipov. Here we go. Zabit knocks him down on the cage and gets in some ground and pound shot. But what's this? Oh, huge kick as he's a downed opponent. That's illegal, bro. Number nine, Xanagats gains UFC two action. Jumping off the cage, collides with his opponent's head, causing him to nearly bounce out of the octagon. My word, what an animation. Come on, EA. We need UFC two knockout physics in UFC five. Next up, number eight, it's Timbo Slice. Oh, he gets rocked to the head, but he ducks the head kick. Oh my goodness. He's out cold after being rocked. Wow, wow, wow. We are live. NZ is back at number seven with Peter Yan. On his back, he gets up, sidestep, and lands one of the most powerful punches I have ever seen landed in the history of UFC 4 gameplay. Next up at number six, it's X finish him. X, UFC 2 action. He's got the crazy calf, and he leaps into the air like Superman, and his opponent drops. What the heck even happened? How on earth? He somehow connects with a kick to the face. Uh, unbelievable. Number five, Dark Oni MC. McGregor versus Holloway. Boom! Cartwheel kick rocks him. Connor is hurt. Oh! He sleeps him. As he was rocked, he connected with that left hand. We have to take a look at that replay. Wowzers! Moving on to number four. It's Wigged Vapor Rub using Jamal Sweet Dreams Hill versus Gustafson. Boom! Wigged lands a shot that KOs Alexander. Hill grabs him and gently lays him down on that canvas. Talk about sweet dreams. Coming in at number three, Neil 8. MMVI using Nate Diaz. He ducks that head kick and delivers a Stockton slap. K oh! Textbook Nate Diaz! It is now time for number two, Swangin' Things, a.k.a. Swaghauser. Ah! Shin-shattering inside the leg kick by Swaghauser. Oh! Wonderboy rocked him with that overhand. Goes for a jumping cross kick, misses, and RDA lands an H-bomb that sends Wonderboy flying into the sky and colliding into the cage. And now the moment you've all been waiting for. Coming in at number one, it is Thyler H with Justin Gaethje. He gets rocked with that uppercut and backs up. He's hurt, taking big shots to the body. Oh! 
Masvidal goes for the head kick. Oh, Thyler ducks and lands a lazy left hook while he was rocked to get the knockout. No way! All right, Joe, thanks so much. You did a great job. No problem, MMA game. It was my pleasure. I would love to do this again sometime. Sounds good, bro. Guys, if you want Joe back for a future episode, let us know in the comments. And don't forget to check the link in the description to send in your own clips and head kick that like button. <laughs> All right, guys. That's the video. All praises to the most high. Till next time, this has been MMA Game. Peace out.